I should just round things up. Like in Australia, we round it to the nearest five cent. But the thing is, we won't take this, I don't think. It's like, can I have a candy bar? We could try. Slip it in there. I might maybe, maybe Frankie will take it. Someone take tips. <laughs> Good morning guys. So we are in Scranton, Pennsylvania. If you guys didn't tell by the intro, I have to do that every time we're here. And Chris and I are going on a little adventure and we're trying just to get out of here. And it's freaking backed up. So where's Dunder, Dunder Mifflin? Mifflin? Yeah, the paper company. Is that around here? The paper company? I know the book company, but I didn't but know. But there's no Dunder Mifflin? No. All right, thank you, man. All right, take care. Every time I go to Scranton. You gotta ask where the paper company is. Nobody knows where Dunder Mifflin is. That or they hear it so much. <laughs> that is just so annoying. Lately our Walmart stops have been like at five or four in the morning and I just can't wake up. Like, I'm literally out sleeping lately by like 11 or 12 p.m. I've been on this amazing sleep schedule. And so Chris and I decided to go be a little bit more proactive. Oh, this is tragic, I love this. This is what I need. You should always know where you're going because we thought we were still in Scranton and Chris and I have been here for about like maybe 45 minutes just waiting for an Uber and uh, there's like nothing here. We're like in the middle of nowhere and we're just sitting here with our thumbs up our ass. The only way I can describe it right now guys. Do you get a lot of people asking where the paper company, the Dunder Mifflin paper company is? You don't get that a lot? Uh, you ever seen The Office? Yeah. It's based in Scranton? Oh, yeah, 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 okay. I just didn't know, I always like to ask, like, like whoever yeah. I'm gonna, like, I would like to go to the paper company. Oh, yeah. So you don't even, you never even knew about that. Uh, well, you really, knew about it now. I didn't watch the show, so. Oh. Hang on, I'm getting a massage right now. It's really intense. Hang on, where's it going, where's it going? Neck, back. <laughs> Look who I'm with. <laughs> Right now, Melissa's getting a, a pedicure and I'm gonna get a manicure in a hot second. <laughs> I've never used this massage sure. Sorry, I, this is, I know, weird. Uh, so I'm getting a massage right now while I'm waiting to get my nails done. And you know what? I could get used to these. Real nice. Real, real nice. How's that massage there? That's how you bring all the boys to the yard. All the boys to the yard. So I went and got my nails done with Melissa. And it was so much fun. It was like, it was nice. It was like a little sister bonding day. So we really, really enjoyed that. Now I have to actually go and get Diesel's medication. I gotta go pick that up because I don't know if I ever told you guys Diesel is on meds because he is crazy and silly as it sounds. He's got, I don't wanna say anxiety because that's not true, but he, um, he tends to get so excited and bark so loud that my vets are afraid that he may potentially give himself a heart attack. So he gets really, really anxious. So I have to put him on some medication that he has to take every single day, um, along with medication for his allergies and things of that sort. So I have to go pick that up now. And then I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do. It's like six o'clock, so I feel like I'm in good shape right now. First off, Kate's here. Second off, I'm actually trying to do all my things, put it all away. I see this random bag, and I open it, and this is what's in it. Don't touch my pizza crust. I need that for a science project. There's like so many questions I have about this situation right now, and not enough answers. Frankie, is this you? Pizza crust and deodorant? deodorant? I gotta see how you're gonna do this. Um, you know tomorrow we have a day off, right? I know, but I'm at the point where I'm wearing smelly clothes and I can't do it anymore. And holy clothes. That's, yeah, there was a moth in my butt last night. <laughs> Wait, whose idea was this? I just asked her to assist me and make sure I didn't do anything wrong. I recommended doing it in the bottom of the shower. Oh, you don't want to do that. Well, I don't know how dirty your guys' shower is. You might as well just do it in that. <laughs> it was a clean shower. Yeah, that would make sense. That stuff smells so fresh. You guys are gonna be like, Whoa. also gotta be very careful not to get any of that detergent in my tattoo open wounds. I was just gonna say, so what's what what what's Kate's job in this? He wants me to guide him. Oh, guide it? That's how you're getting the water? 
<laughs> Stop complaining about my ways. I know, I'm actually, it's ingenious. <laughs> Holy crap. I just went exploring and I just found this. So I've never discovered this water park before. I found out it's only like 15 or 16 bucks and we don't play for like another three hours. Since I'm the only one that didn't get tattooed on the store, I'm really the only one that can actually go because you know, they get infected. Oh, the scooter died halfway up the hill. When I was scooting around just a few minutes ago coming back, I remembered a vivid memory, specifically right here on this mountain. I don't know if you guys remember that one time when Travis really had to go to the bathroom. They were like, don't you do it. And he just put a bag in the toilet and then tried to throw it up there and it just started rolling back down. And to this day, I just remember that hill rolling down with a pile of Travis's poop. So I basically said, fuck it. And I'm going on some water slides today. Basically torment the guys that I'm at a water park right now. <laughs> What's your name? Dominique. Dominique? Yeah. What's I'm, your name? My name's Charles. Oh, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Dominique. All right, have Send fun. Me this. Like Sam's Club is for like old people, but I'm joining the crowd early. I'm very excited. I'm, I'm joining the club early, I should say. Got the prescription, we're all good. I used to love coming here with my grandma on like Sundays because they give us free samples. So what she would do to feed us kids is she would take us here and we would just like walk around and get free samples. One of my favorite things about this place. Trav, let me see your new shirt. Trav's a believer. You want your turkey? Are you ready? Oh, you're so excited. I know. I think I spoiled the dogs because I made 
like a bunch of like ground organic turkey. What are you doing, you weirdo? Um, ground organic turkey the other day. Diesel, what are you doing over there? And uh, I had a whole bunch left over, so I've been giving it to them at dinner time. And I think I'm spoiling them. It's so good, isn't it though? So I'm gonna feed these guys. I'm excited, so he's feeling much better. And um, I think we're gonna go for like a golf cart ride later, maybe. Why not? The beautiful thing about being up in the mountains is the sunset. Oh, I hear there's a birthday. The birthday boy. That's right. You got a big old 30, right? That's right. And we ordered 37 pizzas. Oh, that's not 30. Is that right? We, well, we went, I ordered 30, but we got some more. They gave us, they gave us a couple I guess of when you order 30, you get seven you more. You get seven free. Yeah, like yeah, a baker's that's dozen. That's, dozen, really, dozen that's the compliment. Yeah. That's the deal. Really? Look at the guy yeah, so it's Derek's birthday. Everyone go say happy we'll birthday. Be we'll be hanging. So this is what 30 pizzas look like. My life is complete. Yeah. Feeling old? Um, no, I'm so good. No? Well, you're younger than I am. You're, I think you're younger than every member of We The Kings. Really? Yeah. Mike, how old are you? I'm 30. Okay, you're 32? <laughs> Zach's gonna go pick up some ladies at the Yo, pizza party. I'm <laughs> And dab. Nice. Hit him with a dab. <laughs> <laughs> Go. Do you want to be my roommate? Are you going to the pizza party? I'm going to the pizza party. Charles, Charles went to the pizza party. Said I should go. There's a female friend over there that he would like to meet. Is it like a sock hop? What's a sock hop? You remember the sock hop? Yo. It's like an old school movie. Because you're sticking your hair back, you got your cuffs rolled up. That's what makes me feel Okay, well let's go to the sock hop. He's gonna meet some females. We have this pizza sock hop. And I'm gonna go hop some socks. As well, as you can see, parties are ensuing here in Warp Tour bus land. I don't know what you guys want to call it. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed today's video, and I will see you guys tomorrow as always. Good night, guys. Is that riding CTFXD in it? You ready? CTFXD shirt. Okay, so.